iTrack's intelligent commissioning feature allows you to automatically determine suitable locations for assets and then model the proposed changes. Here, we model the deployment of several servers within a cabinet. After selecting the type of server, we right-click on the proposed cabinet and choose Commission Within. This opens the Commission dialog, where we can verify the information and click Save. The Equipment and Workflow tabs will appear. We can then click the View Template button to review the attributes of the template we'll use for the servers. When ready, we click the Previous Screen button, select the number of servers we want to commission, and then click the Create Equipment button. In this example, three servers are automatically created using the naming convention set in the Name field. These servers all use the template we specified earlier. If we want to make additional changes to one of the servers, we can select it and choose the Configure Equipment button. In this case, we'll just verify that all of the space, power, and connectivity information is correct. Once everything has been verified, we can click the Commission button. The commission process will begin and the dialog will close. At this point, we can return to the cabinet within the viewer and press F to enable Future View. We drag the Future View selector forward to see how the cabinet will appear once the commission within is complete. You can see the servers appear within the cabinet. To view future connectivity, we can zoom in on the servers and select a port. Clicking the Trace button opens the current circuit trace. By right-clicking and choosing Display Future, we can see what the connectivity will look like in the future.